did not see this coming. I knew they were getting ready to release Alpha 11. I did not think that it was due to be released so soon. So, I am going to start a new game on Empyrean on Alpha 11. My name is Nathan. Let's get started. Start again, single player, survival. I'm kind of tired of it being kind of easy. So I am going to change this. I mean, that's all fine. I want hard enemies. High presence. Hydro mist attacks. Honor minor depletion. It's true. Block limits for certain devices. False. False, false. I want volumes to be true. All this stuff looks good, but I want to choose a different starting planet. I think it's just a little too easy starting to breathe the atmosphere. So, where should we go? Arid. Unbreathable. Atmosphere density 1.25. But it's breathable. Jerax, let's start here. Let's see what they added. I'm wondering if 10.6 is experimental, it's just not 11, but we'll give it a shot, see if things are different. Here we go. It's gonna be slightly more challenging. Didn't make it crazy hard, but I did make it so the atmosphere is not breathable. And there's a small wreckage there. It's probably where I'll go first. Probably die a few times, but I'm going to try to survive without dying. I need to find water immediately. A biofuel and a O2 processor. I could do, use that. Alright, what do we got? <laughs> One water. Um... Now let's go ahead and do this, just see if it's different. I want it mainly for the extra points. Alright. Well, let the fun begin. Let's see here. Survival tool. A little bit of food. Health packet. One bottle of water. Let's instantly turn that into a breathable emergency. O2. PDA files. I want to push F1. F1. Oh, okay. That's nice. That's the new thing. Robinson Protocol. Okay, that was fun. I really need to find some source of fuel immediately. Push tab, it says. Open my inventory. Fun, fun, fun. Okay, let's eat the energy bar. Use the health pack. Alright. I guess we keep me alive. Not too concerned about food, it's not set overly high. Let's go ahead and uh, queue some protein bars. Also, are all in your hand, you can freely explore the surrounding just we know of this. It is nice, they gave us no two, so I got that going on. Problem with this plant, there's not a whole lot of trees. Well, there's some over there. I'm gonna let it do its thing while I go check down some trees. Well. I obviously need to unlock the survival constructor so I can make fuel. I want to get level 3 quickly here too so I can make some better weapons. But portable constructor is now unlocked. All I gotta do is track down the right resources for that. Make it so I can start making fuel. I need to find silicon and iron. And usually silicon is down by the water. I got 40 minutes with the fuel that I already put into my constructor. Or my, my O2 condenser. I could have sworn I saw some iron pretty close to here, but if, and usually silicon's down by the water. So I'm gonna go after both of those. <laughs> well, that's exciting. I unlock level 3. See a lot. And so I'm gonna go ahead and unlock the shotgun. Assault rifle. I prefer shotgun. That should be good for now. I don't know what this is supposed to be. If you look up in the screen, it looks like white light blasting across the screen. Maybe it's supposed to indicate... Yeah, I have no idea. That's weird. I could say it may have something to do with being on the dunes and wind, but... I don't know. 
It's weird. Maybe just a glitch. Sweet. We will not be dying. Got just enough silicone, I believe, to make a portable constructor. At which point I can make fuel to keep myself hydrated and oxygenated. I think I'm going to head back. Turn this constructor into uh, something to make feel with. My next goal is going to be to hit level 5. That way I can bring in my Recon 2 HV and actually explore a lot quicker. Going by foot is necessary, but a pain in the butt sometimes. Well, I did some journey, hit level 3. I've now come back to my O2 condenser for the oxygen and for the water. And, um, set down my. Why not? Portable constructor. I didn't have space for it. Yeah. I survived the first night. And, um, I'm gonna call it here. Thank you for taking the time to watch my videos. Go ahead and give me a thumbs up if you like my videos. Click that subscribe button. Click on the bell to be notified when I release a new episode. Until next time, keep surviving.